It's seven weeks since D-Day. To break out of Normandy, we're pushing inland to secure Marignay. That's how we'll control the roadways and plow across France to Paris. Liberation's coming soon. Me and the fellas, I'd say we're doing pretty good. Not good enough for Pearson, but nothing is. Maybe I'll get home by Christmas with a couple medals on my chest. But first, we gotta take Marinier. Schmeling versus Lamada. Schmeling would have KO'd Lamada. No way. And Schmeling's a Nazi. I'd shoot him in a heartbeat. Now, they made him their poster boy. That guy didn't have a choice. We all got a choice. Mm, you know, Nietzsche said there was only oh, a strong... That's enough mouth. All right. Uh, what about Lewis versus Sugar Ray Robinson? If we're talking 1938, Lewis Robinson wins hands down. Hey! Oh, look who came back for more. I thought you were out another week. Not after I heard a bunch of tough SOBs were about to take Marinier. Yeah, well, playbook's working. At this rate, we'll be home by Christmas. Don't just stand there. Let's see. All right. Not bad, eh? Oh. I've seen worse. Glad to have you back, Private. Good to be back, sir. All right, fellas. We got a unique opportunity here. This is our chance to break out of Norman. It won't be easy. The hedgerows are heavily defended. We got reports of crowd armor in the area. But if we can hold and secure Marinier, we own the roadways. And if Zussman can take a knife in the gut and come out swinging, I like our odds just fine. I always bet on a winner, sir. For Turner, shielding us is his noble calling. Let's move. The war just has a habit of getting in the way. You know, a wound like this takes eight weeks to heal. I'm ready, Sergeant. You've got my word. Oh, your word, huh? That don't mean shit to me. So you're good, huh? I'm just fine and dandy, sir. You got guts, Bradley. I just don't want to see him. Tanks rolling! Hang on tight, boys. It's gonna get rough. What else is new? I think Pearson likes you. <laughs> like a lion likes a steak. Let's go, let's go! Looks like you're holding up all right. Yeah, how about yourself? I couldn't let you guys have all the fun. Uh, fun's not allowed under Pearson. You know why he's always writing you? Kasserine Pass. Lost my best friends there. Yeah, earned him an Article 15 and a demotion. He had to be a hard ass, and his men paid the price. Mission was Fubar, a massacre. Nazis had no mercy. No, we only survived because they didn't have time to seal the western exit. Almost lost everything thanks to that son of a bitch. But Turner still ain't over it. Matter of fact, he was the one who wrote him up. But Pearson figures if he makes you a model platoon, He'll get it scrubbed. Only we're doing the scrubbing. <laughs> yeah, now you're getting it. It's why he's never going to give up. He'd kill to have it removed. You know what I'd kill for? Some decent grub. You just had supper. Hey, shit on a shingle doesn't count. Hey, how about barbecue, eh? They never stood a chance. I'm guessing no to the open casket. Now that's somebody's son. Nah, it's a crowd. Uh, Daniels is right. They're not all bad. They did give us Kepler, Mozart. All right, college. Marlena Dietrich. See, that's more like. Don't forget about their inventions. You got the printing press, electron microscope. Frankfurters. You guys are killing me. You guys hear that? It's headed this way. Stukas, inbound. Me out of that. Clear the tanks. Circle around! Move! We have to protect our Shermans. That's in the ditch. We're gonna capture.
capture one of their AA guns and bring down those stupid. Push the fence. We need with our spread out. Move. Push him back. Hey, Perez! Hey, Perez! Yo, 
okay? They got Buddy Mills in the ambush, but we hit him back hard. The holdouts are getting with packs up ahead. Gotta lean them out. All right, Pearson, take a fire team through the orchard and find an overwatch position. After you soften up the packs, I'll lead them into the parade. Yes, sir! Daniels, us! You're with me. Come on. What that? It's artillery. Tank killers. Didn't you read the briefing? What are we supposed to do against tank killers? I was wondering that myself. P-47. <sighs> Damn it. Wish I would've gotten to that flat gun sooner. Those are civilians. It's a war crime. Oh shit. Over here! We've got a vantage point! Oh, Get out your binoculars! There's two residents, boys! We're heading right into hell! We gotta hit those pack operators hard! Everyone open! I got eyes on two Daniel! to good use. All tanks forward!
Lieutenant. Hold on. See you approaching. All right, listen up. Charlie Company's under assault near the church. They need ammo and fire support. Send a squad immediately. Sir, we're already stretched pretty thin. Then stretch thinner. Yes, sir. We can take the jeep, so we're gonna need armored support. All right, that's the plan. Perez! Pearson will follow you with the squad. Can't do it. Just got orders from Collins. We're heading west with the 11th. God damn it. Those boys are running out of time. You're on your own. Take the jeeps and head out. Move! All right, snap to it! Charlie's up shit creek and we're the paddle. Let's go! Let's go! Marinier. Follow this road to the next village over. They turn on it. Go easy. The road splits up ahead. Get on the out for retreating crowds. They'll run right on top of Charlie Company. You gotta get there first. We gotta stop meeting like this. Why don't you be going soft on me, Murphy? Well, thanks for showing up when you did. Thank Captain Davis. It was his orders. Okay. It's too late to press on. It looks like you boys got a reprieve. Excuse me, Sergeant? Yeah. Isn't half the crowd army on the other side of those buildings? Shouldn't we find a better place to set up a perimeter? Sure, Private. Why don't you book us a room at the Ritz? Sir. He's scared as all. Why don't you worry about your own problems? Like how that side is gonna hold up tomorrow. I'm right as rain, Sergeant. Daniels, why don't you watch him? The only thing more dangerous than the enemy is pride. 
Rest up, boys. We take Marinier at first light. Can't believe I'm fighting alongside Zussman again. He's holding up all right, considering we just blasted through miles of hedgerows. You'd think Pearson might go a little easier on him. You'd be wrong.